Hey everybody, Spoonvet here, and uh, a slight change of plans. Uh, I was going to use Backbox Linux as my distro for tools, and Blackbuntu as my distro for the Hack This Mission or uh, Hack This Site missions and stuff, and Hellbound Hackers mission. I'm gonna change it around. So I'm gonna do a mission now in Backbox, and I'm gonna do the tools in Blackbuntu. And I'm not gonna do all the missions in Black Backbox now because. Well, that would be pointless because I re recorded them and stuff like that. So, uh, I'm going to do a another realistic mission. So, fire up that old firebox. I'm gonna go to hack this site dot org. To log in, um, yeah. What was my password again? I don't think that's correct. Hmm. New. Alright, so I'm logged in. Yeah. Password was not available anymore for some reason. Um so 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 what we're gonna do is a new mission, a realistic mission. I'm going to do the peace poetry who's been hacked, take this challenge. It's moderate, okay. I run this website where people can read and submit peace-related poetry. I am doing this out of goodwill towards others, and I don't see why I will be making enemies out of this, but some real asshole hacked my website, posted a bunch of ignorant aggressive propaganda on the front page, and I made that website a while ago, and I no longer have access to it. Do you think you can hack in and change it back? Please, oh, and bonus points if you message me the name of the bastard who did this. My website can be found here. Uh, we also need to know who did it, or is it just by the insane script skitties? Oh yes. Well, as always, let's view the source first. View wrap long lines, please. Do do do. Let's just see. Well, this is just all very much bullshit, and then. At the bottom, we see no to the web page. This has been happened, not totally destroyed. The old is still up. Simply copy the old index file to old index and remade this one. Sorry about the convenience. Inconvenience. Well, what we're gonna do is we're going to go to that old index. So, this was the site before, and as you can see here in read poems. You can uh, see what this is being stored as, and it's probably getting text files. Um, so, if you would like, the name uh, would then be, uh, in this case, hacker. Let me just copy this tab. Can I do that? No? Okay, I'll just do it the old fashioned way. So, mm, makes it a little bit easier for me. So, the name will be Hacker. So, that will be displayed here. So, it will be Hacker. And then all this text will be pasted in here. Like so. And that will be stored as a file and we don't know if that's a PHP file or text file or whatever but what we're gonna do is um, 
it will be stored in a map somewhere which will always be below the uh, map that we want it to be that we want to have to file in. So what we're going to do is we'll store this as the name up one go up one and in XHTML so we'll be in here this map and then go up one so we'll be at uh, three slash and then we'll say index.html and the code that we want to have is actually just this code right here and we can close this one off and if we save this then we'll save the uh, index file that is right now with the old index file which is the correct index file and then we'll have it all back now an extra points for who did this we don't know we cannot see because um, we don't have access to the server logs and whatnot so we won't go as far as that but um, yeah if we hit add poem this should actually be our way to success yes and here we are we've uh, we've done it so what we did is um, we saw that uh, the way this is being stored is not very well so and submit poems to the PHP is does something with it and read the poetry you can uh, do some cool stuff as well just for fun let's see what happens if we do this <laughs> cool awesome <laughs> that isn't allowed alright so uh, yeah we did uh, mission 3 that's it